You know what? I am just done with failed crops. I'm Audrey from Audrey's Little Farm, and I help passion-driven people trailblaze their way to a more self-sufficient life filled with happiness, plants, and chickens. Let me know if you can relate to this. You would love to grow your own vegetables as delicious as all the produce at the farmer's market, but the thought of adding just one more thing to your plate is out of the question. Or maybe you're like I was. This one year, I had a great garden growing. I had put hours of hard work into it and everything was growing amazing. But then this one week, my family and I were about to go on vacation to my favorite place ever, the cabin. And just like every time we head out of town, we have to have family or friends to come take care of animals for us. And so I added watering my garden to the list. But when we got back, everything was dead. So then of course, it just made going on future vacations stressful and a hassle. But the thing that happened that made me realize I needed a big change was the day that I no longer enjoyed gardening. When you work hard preparing your garden beds, planting, watering, and caring for your garden, it is an amazing feeling of accomplishment once you finally get your first harvest. And I truly believe that hard work brings good reward. But there came a point when I was just completely stressed and burnout. Of course, I still wanted to harvest all the fresh vegetables, but I no longer wanted to do the everyday work like watering. And the common problem we can all relate to, big or small, is that there are days when we just don't want to do it. And by it, that could mean cooking dinner, cleaning the house, watering your garden when it's 100 plus degrees outside, pulling weeds, feeding the chickens, whatever it might be. But as you know, we can't just quit watering our garden or we end up with plants looking like this. And so I had to figure out a way to simplify my gardening tasks so that I could reclaim my time while still growing successful crops. And let me tell you, this simple solution changed my life. I set my entire garden up on an irrigation system with a timer so whether I am feeding my chickens, harvesting vegetables, or simply doing housework, my garden watering is taken care of. It's a task that will initially take you a couple hours to set up depending on the size of your garden, but it will save you hours of work in the future. And so now as I pack up to head to the cabin, I'm leaving stress-free because I know I'll return to a well-watered and thriving garden. If I could give only one piece of gardening advice to anybody, it would be to set your garden up with a timer and an irrigation system from day one. Don't wait until you reach that point of being so stressed out and overwhelmed. The only thing that tends to stress me out now in the garden is weeds. But this year I've actually been very diligent about keeping up with them. But there are two tools that I talk about in this video right here that have made a world of difference. So go over there and check it out because you're definitely going to want to get them.